Whether you're ready to buy or just wanting to give Diamond Maps a try, the first step is to create an account using the 30-day free trial button on our website. An account is a list of people who work together on the same map. If you've already received an email from Diamond Maps informing you of your username and password, that means someone else already created an account and added you to it. If that's the case, click the Sign In button instead to log into the existing account. This video will assume that you're the first person in your department using Diamond Maps, so you'll want to click the 30-day free trial button. Diamond Maps just needs to know three things. First, your email address is how the system will identify you. This will be your username that you can use to log in each time. As the creator of this account, you will also be the account manager, which means you're the only person who can add other users to this account. Secondly, you need to indicate where this map is located. You'll be able to view anywhere in the world from your map, but this location specifies where your map should be centered each time you first open it. This will take a variety of location names, but it's simplest to just put in the city and state here. You can go back later and adjust your map to initially show a different area. Thirdly, indicate the name of your company or municipality. This will be the name for the account. If you were given a promo code to identify how you heard about us, enter it here, but this is optional. Then lastly, click Go. After a few seconds, a success screen will appear with a web address that takes you to your new map. Use this same web address on your PC, tablet, or phone to go directly to your map. The second link is more administrative and can be used to do things like manage payment or create new users and maps. If you try to go to either of these links, you'll see that it's asking you to log in with your username and password. Your password's being sent to you via email, so let's switch over to our email program and wait for that. Within a couple minutes, you should receive an email from diamondmaps.com that looks like this one, with the subject line, Your New Account. If you don't see it in your inbox, be sure to check your junk mail folder to see if it went there. The most important thing in this email is your username and password. This is a computer-generated password that you can change later if you like. The email also contains the two web addresses that we talked about just a minute ago. So be sure to print or save this email somewhere that you can refer back to in the future. So let's click on the map link to go to our map. We don't let just anyone view your map, so you got to prove who you are by entering your username and password. This is the same username and password that was just sent to you in an email. If you're using a personal computer, tablet, or phone that's not shared with any other people, then check the Keep Me Logged In box and Diamond Maps will automatically log you in the next time you open your map from this same computer. If you want to change your password, this is a good time to do so using this link here. If you ever forget your password, click here and we'll email you a reminder. So there you go. That's how you create your first map. You should save this web address as either a shortcut on your computer or save it as one of your favorites in your browser. The next time you want to open your map, you just have to return to this web address. Check out some of the other videos to see what to do next with your new map.